good evening everyone good evening ma'am good evening ma'am good evening ma'am good evening so we'll just start the session please come to a comfortable seated position <clears throat> Good evening. Good evening. Yes, so keep your cameras on. If my mics off, please keep your mics all off. And then we'll start the session. So sit in a comfortable position with folded legs, palms resting on your knees, shoulders roll back, spine straight, close your eyes. And take few rounds of deep inhalation and deep exhalations. Try to bring your entire focus towards your breathing. Apna pura dhyan, apna focus, apni breathing ki o leke aayenge. And feel the in and out movement of air in your body. Ma'am, can't hear you. See, I guess others are able to hear me. Please check it at your the voice. It might be yes, ma'am. We are able to hear you. This is not audible at all. We can hear. We can hear. You just check your mic at your Yes, please check at your end. Yes, so with each inhalation and exhalation, try to bring in all the positive energies in your mind and body with each inhalation. And with each exhalation, try to release any kind of stress, tension, pain or any negativities in your mind and your body. Just feel that with each inhale and exhale, your body is becoming more light. Now you can gently rub your palm. Place your palms on your eyes, all over your face, and then open your eyes. Yes, so now we'll start with our seated body stretches. So everyone bring your palms in front. Let's do palm up and down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Now make a fist and do the wrist rotation. One. Two, three, four, and five. Opposite. One, two, three, four, and five. Arms in line with the shoulders and then make circles, big circles. One, two, three, four, and five. Opposite direction. One, two, three, four, and five. Relax your palms on the knees. We'll do next stretching. Starting with inhale, neck up. Exhale, neck down. Five counts. One, two, three, four, and five. Now, next side to side. Right to left. One, two, three, four. And five. Now we'll do next stretching by placing the right palm on the left ear. Everyone place your right palm on the left ear. Very gently turn your head to right side and feel gentle stretch across the neck and hold for five counts. One, two, three, four, and five. Slowly release. Now place your left palm on the right ear. Again, very gently. Don't Put much pressure on the head. Very gently turn and hold. One, two, three, four, and five. Slowly release. Now neck rotation. Two clockwise, two anti-clockwise. Start from center. Slowly with inhalation. Take your head to the back side. Exhale. Bring it in front. One. 
and two. Opposite direction. One. And two. Now you can relax your neck. Yes, relax your neck, everyone. Yeah, now with inhalation, raise both the arms up. With exhalation, bend forward. Pura aagi ki taraf bend karenge. Stretch your arms to the front. Look down and fold. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Slowly walk your palms towards the right side of the body, everyone. Stretch your body towards the side. Look down and hold. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Slowly walk your palms towards left side. Again, stretch and hold. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, and ten. Slowly come back to center with inhalation arms up, everyone, and release your arms. Now we will sit in dandas. Dandas in the bedding, so legs straight in front. Sit like this. Yeah, so we are going to do forward bend pose, which is called as Paschimottanasana. Inhalation arms up with exhalation, bending forward, keeping spine straight. Back straight. If you can catch your toes, catch it. If not, then ankle or your shin bone. Any of these areas you can hold. Let's start it together. With inhalation, arms up everyone. With exhalation, bend forward from the hip joints. Spine straight everyone. And hold. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Inhale, come back to center, release your arms. Now fold your left leg. Everyone fold your left leg. Then we have to hold the foot in this position. Okay. So after holding the foot, slowly we'll straighten the leg. Dere se leg ko straight karenge. Keeping your back straight. But if you're not able to do it, agar aapka leg straight nahi ho hai, you can hold your foot. You can hold your ankle or your calf muscles also and this way also you can stretch your leg. Let's do it everyone slowly. Hold the foot, ankle or calf. Straighten the leg, back straight, spine straight, look to the front. 10 counts hold. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10. Now keep holding your foot with right palm. Left arm back side straight, look back, twist your spine and hold everyone. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Slowly come back to center, release the leg. Now do the same with other leg. Yes, hold your foot, ankle or calf, then slowly straighten the leg. Spine straight, everyone. Look to the front and hold. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Now keep holding your leg with your left palm, right arm back side. Again, look back and hold. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9 and 10. Slowly come back to center. Release your leg. Now we'll come to, again keep your leg straight. Just fold your right leg. Place your right foot on the top of your left thigh. We are going to do half butterfly flapping first. Yes, right foot on the top of left thigh. Then we will do the flapping of right leg. When you are taking it down, just apply gentle pressure so that it can go more down towards the floor. 10 counts everyone. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Switch the leg. Switch the leg, everyone. Again, ten counts of this movement. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 
9 and 10. Now bring both legs together in butterfly. Hold your legs, hold your feet with your palms back straight and gently start flapping the legs. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 10 more. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10. Now we, we are going to do forward bend. So take a deep inhale first. With exhalation, bend forward as much as your body allows. Look down everyone and hold. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10. Inhale, come back to center. Slowly release the pose. Let's come to a standing position. Now we'll start with a standing workout. Yes, please come to a standing position, everyone. Yes. Now, firstly, we'll do the shoulder mobility. So, place your palms on your shoulders and then very gently start rotating your arms. One, two, three, four, and five. Opposite direction. One. Two, three, four, and five. Now relax your arms. Next, we'll do is both arms in front of the chest with inhalation, taking them to side, exhale front. Inhale side, exhale front. Let's do this one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Very good. Eight, nine, 10, two more, one and two. Very good. Relax your arms. Thoda sa shake karin ye arms ko. Yes. Now place your palms on the knees. Slightly bend everyone and start rotating. Do the knee rotations. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine and ten. Opposite direction. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Come back to center. Yes. Next we'll do is leg rotation for the pelvic joint. So we'll place our palms on the waist. Inhale, lifting right leg up. Exhale, down from side. So full circle with the leg. Ten counts on right leg. Ten on the left side. Let's do it. Palms on the waist. And then start. One. Two, three, <clears throat> four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Very good. Relax your right leg. Now let's do it on the left leg. Ten palms on the waist. Inhale, lift your left leg up. Exhale down from side. One. Two, three, four, <clears throat> five, six. Come on, everyone. Seven, eight, nine, and ten. And relax. Everyone relax. Yes. Now, next we will do. So, today we are going to do moon salutation and sun salutation. So, moon salutation will do. Firstly, and then after that, multiple rounds of sun salutation. So, moon salutation, we always start from right edge. We move towards the left and then we move from left towards the right side. So, we will do it together. Each and every step, you have to follow me. What I am doing, you have to do with me. Okay? Every person ka jo flow hai moon salutation, we will do it karenge. So, firstly, you all have to come to right edge of the mat. Apni mat ke right side mein jaiye. Everyone, you are right, okay? Yes. Legs together. 
with inhalation raise your arms up join your palms above parvatasan exhale bend towards your right side inhale come back to center exhale left side bend inhale come back to center now take your left foot away from the right so we'll take our left foot away from the right because we have to go into goddess now so now slowly bend your knees arms to the side go down to goddess everyone five counts hold here 1 2 3 4 and 5 leg straight arm straight now we'll do right side triangle pose so right foot external rotation left foot pointing forward slowly with exhalation place your right palm either on the right shin bone or ankle and five counts hold triangle pose 1 2 3 4 and 5 now both the palms we have to place it on the sides of the right foot pyramid pose parshvottanasan release your head down if you can if not keep your neck relaxed and hold 1 2 3 4 and 5 now back foot so our back foot is our left foot place it on toes bring it on toes take it one step back one step back drop the back knee down so now we are here into ashva sanchalan so look to the front and hold into ashva sanchalan 1 2 3 4 and 5 from here everyone listen from here we have to turn our body towards the front with the help of our palms and feet like this and we'll go to skandhasan aram se take your time turn your body your feet towards front direction your left leg will remain straight right leg will be folded <clears throat> either join your palms or keep them down any of the, these two is fine and we are here into skandhasan this will be little challenging but jitna aap se ho bhai just do that much and hold 1 2 3 4 and 5 now from here with the help of our palms we'll move from right side to left side skandhasan yes everyone take your time move towards left and now into left side skandhasan so the asans that we we did on the right side right side mein jo humne flow kiya asans ka abhi hum reverse mein so we'll repeat it in reverse on the left side Hold for five counts. One, two, three, four, and five. Palms down. Very gently turn your body towards left direction and left side. Ashva Sanchalan Asan. Everyone, left direction. Turn करिए. Ashva Sanchalan में जाएंगे and hold. One, two, three. Four and five. Lift your back knee up. Back knee को ऊपर उठाएंगे. Lift it. Take your back foot one step forward and let your right foot face to the front direction. When we are here into Parshvottanasan pyramid pose. Five counts. Hold everyone. One, two, three, four, and five. Now place your left palm on the left ankle. Slowly. राइट आर्म आप लेफ्ट पार्म लेफ्ट एंकल पे राइट आर्म को ऊपर करेंगे त्रिकोणासन ट्राइंगल पोज एंड होल्ड वन टू बोथ लेग स्ट्रेट थ्री फोर एंड फाइव वेरी गुड स्लोली लिफ्ट योर होल बॉडी आप एवरी वन बोथ योर फीट पॉइंटिंग डायगनली स्लोली गो डाउन टू गॉडेस एंड होल्ड वन टू थ्री Four and five. Leg straight. Bring your right foot along with your left. Right foot ko left foot ke pass mein. Join your palms above. Parvatasan. Inhale in the center. Exhale. Left side bend. Inhale center. Exhale right side bend. Inhale come back to center. And release. Take five seconds break everyone, and then we'll move from. left side to right side
Ma'am, this asana is really tough. I am not able to do this at all. Which asana you are talking about? Which we did just now. I can't bend okay. much. I can't keep my legs straight. So you are talking because about I am a beginner. I, I don't have that much flexibility, so I don't know what to do. See, first of all, you need to do is keep your camera on. And uh, secondly, if you are not able to do it at all, if you are not able to do it, just use a stool. And for first time, those people who are doing for first time, it will be difficult. It will be challenging. It's not easy for even who are practicing it regularly. For them also, it won't be that easy. But practicing it regularly will only help you to be habitual of these asanas. So don't worry if you're not able to do that. That's why I'm saying do it in your comfortable way. Okay? It's not that you have have to do perfect right now. You learn it gradually. Okay. Ma'am? Ma'am? Yes. yes. Uh, while we are in Kandasan, uh, we have to keep our hands in Namaskara Mudra, right? On that time, yes. we, yeah. we, we are doing on left side means that uh, like this pose, this, uh, this leg is up, uh, I mean, my foot will be on upper uh, flat only. See, uh, you have to basically put the foot uh, keep your foot flat but if you are not able to do it if it is not becoming flat you can keep it on toes also that is also fine uh, and if, if you are not able if you are not able to join your palms just place them down just keep the support take the support again it will come with practice and practice you'll be able to do it very easily when you'll practice it regularly okay, okay. so you can keep down. your palms down if yes. we are if we are in skandhasan our leg is in position like as uh, Asusan Chalanasan or uh, like this bend also? Malasan, like a Malasan. Like Malasan. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Thank you. Yes. Ma'am, yes, ma now uh, let's do it from left to right. Sorry. This last okay. question, ma'am. Skandhasan me agar hamara pair toe pe hai, to usko full lane ke liye hum kya practice kare ki wo pair pe pura a jai? Dekho, usko alag se bhi hum practice karenge. So, abhi hum flow mein kar rahe hain, isle it will be much challenging. Hum usko alag se bhi baad mein, in further sessions, we'll practice it alone, skandhasana also. Then I'll show you kaise karenge, okay? Uh, Ma'am, yeah. one more question. Uh, in skandhasana, we have hmm. to keep the uh, foot folded uh, like the uh, the down on top or how should we keep the other leg which we have folded see i i guess someone else have already asked the same question please listen to the answers of others questions also so that we are not repeating it again and again so what i have said when you when the leg is folded so this leg if it is folded you can keep it flat or you can keep it on toes also both are fine. So one is floating skandhasana and one is normal skandhasana. This will be a little challenging wherein the foot is flat. So you, it's totally fine if you keep it on toes for right now. With practice, it will be flat. So, uh, ma'am, one more. Uh, See, uh, actually, if we, if we take all the questions right now, it will be difficult and all the time will go in questions only and you won't be able to get the benefits of Whatever we practice. Oh, ma'am, just one thing. Uh, that when you are doing to the left side, uh, it would be more appropriate if we will just see you and then afterwards we will do it. Because when we are uh, leaning downwards now, we are not able to see your posture that which leg has to be kept straight and which has to be folded. So uh, once we have done with you and once if we will watch you just doing, so it would be clear for us in the next round to follow you the same. So you want me to do first and then you will do it? Or how you uh, want to do it? Uh, yes, ma'am. Ma'am, if everybody agrees, because first we have done with you. So, uh, while leaning now, we were not able to watch you that which body posture is have to be straight or which has to be bent. So, uh, now if we will just uh, see you uh, means doing these steps, it would be more clear to see, us. See, I would suggest those who want to practice because of the shortest of time, I'll be doing it only once now. So those who want to see, they can see me. Those who want to practice with me, they can practice it with me. Both, I am comfortable with both. Okay? So just decide according to your, whatever you want to see or you want to do, let's do it. Left side to right side. Okay? 
and best thing to do is keep your mat in this position in which i have kept so that you are able to follow every asan with me because in this position you will be able to see me so aapko sirf ek gardan side mein ghuma ke sirf ek bar ek look dekhna hai so then you can follow and it's totally your choice if you want to see okay yes everyone those who want to practice left side of the mat legs together with inhalation raise both the arms up parvatasan exhale bend towards your left side inhale come back to center exhale right side bend inhale come back to center now take your right foot away from the left everyone right foot away from the left now slowly bend your knees go down to goddess and five counts hold everyone 1 2 3 Four and five. Leg straight. Right foot pointing to front. Left foot pointing to side. Slowly we'll go to three cone asan. Left side three cone asan. So left palm either on the shin bone or on the ankle and hold. One, two, three, four and five. Now we have to place both our palms on the sides of our left foot. लेफ्ट फुट के साइड में प्लेस करेंगे लेग्स विल रिमेन स्ट्रेट इफ यू आर नॉट एबल टू कीप योर पार्म्स डाउन यू कैन बेंड योर फ्रंट नी लिटिल बिट एंड होल्ड वन टू थ्री फोर एंड फाइव नाउ बैक फुट सो बैक फुट इज आर राइट फुट ब्रिंग इट ऑन टोर्स टेक इट वन स्टेप बैक ड्रॉप द बैक नी डाउन लुक टू द फ्रंट अश्व संचालन आसन एंड Hold one, two, three, four, and five. Now from here we are going to do skandhasan. So with the help of our palms, we'll turn our body towards the front. Right leg will remain straight. Left leg will be folded. Either join your palms or keep them down. It's totally your choice. And then hold into skandhasan. Take your own time to adjust yourself. And then. Hold one, two, three, four, and five. Now right side, left side to right side skandhasan. So with the help of your palms, move towards your left side. Sorry, right side and right side skandhasan. Everyone, hold, hold for five counts. One, two, three, four, and five. Now place your palms down. We'll move to right side. Right direction. Me, hame Ashwa Sanchalan is done. So use your palms, turn your feet, and look towards the front to right direction. Ashwa Sanchalan Asan and hold. One, two, three, four, and five. Back foot on the toes. Back foot on the toes. Lift your back knee up. Take your back foot one step forward. And our back foot is our left foot. Let me tell you, left foot, our back foot, is. So, we'll front direction. We face. करेंगे. Both legs straight. Release your head down to pyramid pose. Paschvottanasan and hold. One, two, three, four, and five. Now place your right palm on the right ankle. Again, I'm saying right palm, right ankle, left arm straight up. And triangle pose, trikonasan, and hold. One, two, three, four, and five. Inhale, lift your whole body up. Your feet should be pointing diagonally, and slowly bend your knees. Go down to goddess. Everyone, goddess pose, baby asan. Hold. One, two, three, four, and five. Legs straight. Bring your left foot towards right. Again, left foot ko right foot ke pass me leke aenge. Join your palms above. Parvatasan. Inhale in the center. Exhale. Right side bend. Inhale center. Exhale. Left side bend. Inhale. Come back to center and release. So this was our moon salutation. Just take five seconds break. Then we'll move to sun salutations.
yes so moon salutation is challenging no doubt abhi because we are doing it like many of you are doing it for the first time so it will be challenging don't worry when we'll practice it regularly again and again it will be very easy it's just a flow of asan is pe hum ek asan se dusre asan mein move kar rahe hain and that too only one asan is challenging baaki ke asans are very easy to do and very good for people with pcod pcos so females ke liye reproductive health ke liye it's very very good to practice this moon salutation all the asans in this are for the pelvic opening hip opening now next we'll do is sun salutations we'll do it in two sets and first set two rounds karenge second set pe time ke according we'll do either one or two rounds so two means two with right two with left Firstly, I am demonstrating. एक बार मैं डिमॉन्स्ट्रेट कर रही हूँ एक बार देखिए अच्छे से वेन यू विल डू इट सो यू हैव टू कम टू द फ्रंट ऑफ द मैच वेन ज्वाइनिंग पैम्स इन प्राणा मासना इन हेल आम सासना एक्सेल कीपिंग स्पाइन स्ट्रेट बेंडिंग फॉरवर्ड टू पाद हस्तासन देन यू कैन स्लाइटली बेंड योर नीज पाम्स ऑन द साइड ऑफ द फीट टेकिंग वन लेग पैक Dropping back knee down, looking to front. Ashva Sanchalan Asan. Exhale. Other leg also back. Taking hips up. Adho Mukha Shwan Asan. Then dropping knees down, pushing chest between both palms, chin down, Ashtanga. Inhale, sliding upper body up to Bhujang Asan. Exhale, taking hips up, Adho Mukha Shwan Asan. Inhale, bringing one foot between both the palms, dropping back knee down, looking to front, Ashva Sanchalan. Exhale, other leg also in front, two Pad Hasta Asan. Inhale, arms up, Astuta Asan, and exhale to Pranam Asan. So these are your twelve steps of sun salutations. Let's start, everyone. First round, right leg. Quickly come to the front of the mat. Yes. Now join your palms in pranamasan. Inhale, arms up, hastutanasan. Exhale, keeping spine straight, bend forward to pad hastasan. Back straight, relaxing everyone. Come on, sit up. Now you can slightly bend your knees. Palms के बिल्कुल side में अपने legs feet के side में palms को रखेंगे. Take your right, right leg back, right leg back. Drop the back knee down. Look to the front. Ashwa Sanchalan Asan. Exhale. Other leg also back. Take your hips up. Adho Mukha Shwan Asan. Now drop your knees down and try if you can keep your hips up and only and only push your chest down. So keeping hips up. Push your chest down, chin down. Ashtanga Namaskaram. Inhale, slide your upper body up to Bhujangasan, everyone. Exhale, take your hips up again. Adho Mukha Shwanasana. Inhale, bring your right leg between both the palms. Right foot ko dono palms ke beech mein. You can do it in two steps. अगर एक step में नहीं हो रहा है पहले बीच में लेके आओ and then adjust and bring it between both the palms. Back knee drop. Look to the front. Ashwa Sanchalan. Exhale. Other leg also in front. Two Pad Hastasan. Inhale. Arms up. Hastutanasan. And exhale to Pranamasan. Yes. Now with the left leg, everyone. Again, join your palms in pranamasan. One, everyone. Inhale, arms up, hastutanasan. Exhale, bend forward to pad hastasan. I've spotlighted one video. जिन्हें थोड़ा confusion है, वो उसको follow कर सकते हैं. Inhale, left leg back, ashva sanchalan. Left leg पीछे, सामने देखेंगे. Exhale, other leg also back. Take your hips up, Adho Mukha Shwan Asan. Now drop your knees down. Push your chest between both palms. Chin down, Ashtanga. Inhale, slide your upper body up 
तो भुजंग आसन एवरीवन सामने देखिए परितोषिका एक्सेल टेक योर हिप्स अप अधो मुखा श्वान आसना हिप्स अप एवरीवन इनहेल लेफ्ट लेग बिटवीन बोथ द पाम्स लेफ्ट फुट को दोनों पाम्स के बीच में ड्रॉप द बैक नी डाउन पीछे के नी को ड्रॉप करिए एंड सामने देखेंगे अश्व संचालन एक्सेल अदर लेग ऑल्सो इन फ्रंट टू पाद हस्तासन इनहेल हस्त प्राणासन एंड एक्सेल टू प्राणामासन वेरी गुड नाउ विद दी नाउ द सेकेंड राउंड राइट लेग एवरी वन those who are tired you can skip people those who are doing for first time if you want to skip you can skip others continue in join your palms in pranamasan everyone inhale arms up hastutanasan exhale bend forward to pad hastasan palms on the sides of the feet right leg back ashva sanchalan सामने देखेंगे अश्व संचालन में भी वहां सामने मतलब अपने फ्रंट में एक्सेल अदर लेग ऑल्सो बैक टेक योर हेप्स अप अधो मुखा श्वान आसन यस वेरी गुड गीतांजलि नाउ ड्रॉप योर नीज डाउन पुशे चेस्ट बिटवीन बोथ फार्म्स चिन डाउन अष्टांग इनहेल स्लाइड योर अपर बॉडी अप टू भुजंग आसन एवरी Exhale, take your hips up again. Adho Mukha Shwanasan. Inhale, right leg between both the palms to Ashwa Sanchalan. Exhale, other leg also in front to Padhastasan. Dono leg samne. Inhale, Hastutanasan and exhale to Pranamasan. Very good, everyone. Now with the left leg, and then we'll take a break. Again, join your palms in pranamasan. Come on, Dolly. Inhale, arms up, hastutanasan. Exhale, bend forward, padhastasan. Inhale, left leg back, ashvasanchalan. Very good, Durga. Exhale, other leg also back, hips up, adho mukha shwanasan. Come on, Neetu, hips up. Now drop your knees down. Try करो कि hips ऊपर रहे and push only your chest down between both the palms. Chin down, Ashtanga. Come on, Lopa. Go down. Very good. Inhale, slide your upper body up to Bhujangasan. Exhale, take your hips up again. Adho Mukha Shwanasan. Hips up, Mamta. Inhale, left foot between both the palms, Ashwa Sanchalan. Exhale, other leg also in front, two Padhastasan, Manjwani. Inhale, Hastutanasan, raise your arms up and exhale to Pranamasan. Very good, everyone. Take a break. Ten seconds ka break leave you. Take a sip of water if you need, and then we'll move further. Yes, we'll be doing one more set. One more set of sun salutation. उसके बाद in the end we'll be doing face yoga exercises. So we'll just do one round, one round as in one round with right leg and then one with left leg. उसके बाद अब face yoga करेंगे. Let's do it, everyone. Back to your position. दोबारा से अपनी positions पे आ जाइए. Front of the mat. Yes. Join your palms in Pranamasan, everyone. Inhale, arms up, Hastutanasan. Exhale, keeping your spine straight, bend forward to Padhastasan. Slightly bend your knees, palms on the sides of your feet. Right leg back, Ashwa Sanchalan. Drop the back knee down and Samne Dekhi, everyone, look to the front. Exhale, other leg also back. Take your hips up, Adho Mukha Shwanasan. Hips up, everyone. 
Drop your knees down. Push your chest between both palms. Chin down. Ashtanga. Inhale. Slide your upper body up to Bhujangasana. Yes. Upper body up from knees. Your palms should be, your weight should be on your palms. Exhale. Take your hips up. Adho Mukha Shwanasana. Hips up everyone. Knees also up. Inhale, right leg between both the palms. Bring your right leg in front between both the palms to Ashwa Sanchalan and look to the front. Exhale, other leg also in front to Padha Hastasan. Dono legs samne. Inhale, arms up, Hastuttanasan and exhale to Pranamasan. Very good. Now with the left leg, again everyone join your palms in Pranamasan. Inhale, arms up, Hastuttanasan. Exhale, bend forward to Padhastasan. Spine straight, Kamar Siddhi rakhenge, legs be straight rahenge pehle, Padhastasan mein. Then, when you take your leg back, bend your knees, palms on the sides of the feet, left leg back, Ashwasanchala. Sides of the feet, matlab, apne pairo ke side mein palms ko rakhna hai. Exhale, other leg also back. Take your hips up. Adho Mukha Shwanasan. Hips up, everyone. Now drop your knees down. Push your chest between both palms. Dono palms ki beech mein chest ko push kariye. Go down to Ashtanga. Inhale, slide your upper body up to Bhujangasan. Exhale, take your hips up again. Adho Mukha Shwanasan. Come on, Karishma, hips up. Inhale, left foot between both the palms. Ashwa Sanchalan. Samne dekhi, everyone, look to the front. Exhale, other leg also in front to Padhastasan. Inhale, Hastuttanasan. And exhale to Pranamasan. Yes, very good, everyone. Now, we are done with our sun salutations. Now we will face yoga. Karenge, so you can come down on your mats. You can sit on your mat. Chahiye. Yes, so this face yoga exercising uh, exercises will help you to relax and cool down your body also because of the intense workout there would be heat energy in your body to relax uh, that also this face yoga will help and instead of doing shavasana we are doing face yoga exercises so the purpose of doing this is firstly increasing blood circulation on our face to so that our skin can be more glowing and secondly, to tone the loose muscles. Ya fir loose skin jo hai mare face mein, usko tone karne ke liye, we are doing. First exercise that we will do is balloon pose with tapping across the face. So you have to fill the air inside your mouth like this. Like a balloon, you have to fill the mouth. Then with the tips of your fingers, you have to do the circular motion tapping. Around your cheeks, on your forehead. Circular motion tapping. We'll do it for 10 counts. 10 counts ke liye hum karenge. Then we'll relax. We'll take one deep inhale and exhale. And each exercise will do three rounds. Three rounds karenge. Secondly, we'll do it with closed eyes so that we can feel that impact of these exercises on our face. And breathing will be continuous through your nose. Breath ko hold nahi karna. So you don't have to hold your breath. Keep breathing from your nose. Just Holding air in your mouth. Let's do it. Everyone back straight. Palms resting on your knees. Shoulders roll back. Eyes closed. Take one deep inhale and exhale. Let's start the first round. Fill the air inside your mouth. And then start circular motion. Tapping across the cheeks and the forehead. One. Two, three, four, five, six, 
seven, eight, nine, and ten. And relax. Relax your cheeks, relax your palms. Take one deep inhale and exhale. Let's do the second round again. Fill the air inside your mouth. And let's start circular motion tapping. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And ten, and relax. Relax, release the air. Take one deep inhale and exhale. Let's do the third round. Again, fill the air inside your mouth. And then start circular motion tapping. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten, and relax. Release the air, everyone. Take one deep inhale and exhale. And open your eyes. Now, the next exercise that we are doing is for the double chin area and for reducing the puffiness of the cheeks. So with mouth, what we'll do is we'll do fish twist mouth. So making a pout first and then sucking the cheeks in and out like this. So in and release. In and release. So you have to suck the cheeks in and then release it. Just like a fish. Ten times we'll do it. And to include the double chin area, we'll do it with neck uplifted. So neck ko upar ki taraf lift karenge, stretch karenge muscles ko. And then when we'll do this with the mouth, it will stretch the entire cheeks and your double chin area. Three rounds again, everyone. Back straight, shoulders roll back, eyes closed. Let's do the first round. So lift your neck up, make a pound. Then suck the cheeks in and out. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Relax. Bring your neck down. Touch your chin to the chest. Three counts ko hold to relax your neck. One, two, and three. Inhale. Come back to center. Let's do the second round. Again, lift your neck up, everyone. Make a bow. Then suck the cheeks in and out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Again, relax your cheeks, bring your neck down, tuck your chin to the chest, three counts hold, one, two, and three. Come back to center. So we'll do the last round of this exercise. Again, lift your neck up, everyone. Make a pow, suck the cheeks in and out. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. And relax, release. Stuck your chin to the chest again. Three counts hold. One, two, and three. Come back to center and open your eyes.
now the last exercise for today will be for the eyes so around our eyes we have dark circles because of stress and again less blood flow there so what we'll do is with our index finger keeping our eyes closed index finger ko inner corner pe rakhenge and then very gently you have to tap across the eyes around the eyes like this so around the eyes we'll do this tapping gentle tapping forcefully nahi karna hai because eyes are very sensitive forceful se injury ho sakte gentle tapping 10 times we'll do it we'll take a break of one deep inhale exhale and similarly we are going to do three rounds of this exercise this is very good for people who have weak eyesight plus those who have laptop work kaafi zyada jinhe screen ke samne baithna padta hai so that i'm also it's very good and very relaxing for the eyes okay Let's do it. Back straight again. Fly eyes closed, everyone. Let's start the first round. Index finger in a corner, and then start the circular motion tapping. One, two, three, four, five. Seven, eight, nine, and ten, and relax. Take one deep inhale and exhale. Let's do the second round again. Index finger in the corner and stop. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, <clears throat> eight, nine, and ten. Again, relax your palms. Take one deep inhale and exhale. Let's do the third round, and let's start. One, <clears throat> two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And turn and relax. Relax your palms. Feel the impact of this exercise around your eyes. That soothingness, that calmness in your eyes. Now we'll conclude our practice with three chants of Om. Keep your eyes closed. Join your palms in front. Take a deep inhale and with exhalation chant Om. Om. Oh, oh. Take a deep inhale and exhale. Rub your palms. Place your palms on your eyes or over your face. Can drop your palms, place it on your neck, your shoulders, and run them through your entire body towards the feet. Thank you so much, everyone. Thank you for joining the session. That is all for today. Any queries, any questions, you can ask me right now. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you.
मैम मॉर्निंग में आप नाइन ए एम की क्लास लेते हैं क्या तो सेवन और एट की नहीं लेते नाइन ए एम वाली लेते हैं ना तो आई कैन ज्वाइन दैट इफ आई वॉन्ट यस यस मॉर्निंग फर्स्ट अर्ली इन द मॉर्निंग होता है फाइव थर्टी एम एंड देन सेकेंड वन इज नाइन एम ओके मैम एंड मैम आप हथी योगा भी कराते हैं क्या ओके यस तो हथ योगा वी आर डूइंग इट इन आर सेशन एक्चुअली हथ योगा इज जस्ट द आसन दैट वी प्रैक्टिस वेर इन वी होल्ड इन टू दसन वेर इन वी आर फॉलोइंग द ब्रीदिंग पैटर्न प्लस प्राणायाम दैट वी आर डूइंग दैट कम्स इन हथ योगा ओनली सो वी आर ऑलरेडी डूइंग इट इन देशन ओके 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 थैंक यू Ma'am, I know that that uh, Sadhguru's video has got famous, and many people are curious to know ki hathi yoga yeah. kya hai and all. So I I know I many people have asked me the same question. So I understand yeah. that. Yeah, especially when he said that women are not conceiving at twenty yes. one, so they should right. do. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. I know that. I know that. Okay, thank you. So don't worry, we are doing already doing it in our sessions. Okay. Ma'am. Yes. Yeah. Through yoga, do we lose weight? Yes, definitely we lose weight through yoga. But not only yoga. Along with that, you have to do diet also. So you have to follow a good, healthy okay. uh, diet. And along with that, if you are attending the sessions regularly, not like doing one or two days in a week, but every day, all five days, you have to be consistent. Then definitely okay. you will lose weight. Thank you, ma'am. Ma'am. Is there any asanas for uh, chest fat, breast fat? Yes. So all the asanas wherein we are working on the upper body, upper body stretch is there. Even when we do these arm circles, so it's not about only the shoulders. It it stretches the whole entire upper body, which works on our chest muscles and fat also. Apart from that, that bhujangasan that was there in the sun salutation, bhujangasan. And has sutta asan. So all the asans wherein your upper body is stretching that helps in reducing the unnecessary fat around your upper body, including your chest. Yeah, thank you, ma'am. Okay. Yeah. And ma'am, what about the belly fat? Belly fat, yes. Again, for belly fat, we work on core. Core is your belly only. So abdominal muscles. We work on that on every Thursday. but it's not that only belly fat exercises will help you to reduce this belly fat you have to work on the entire body so when you work out with your entire body all body muscles you are including that helps in toning of your body so toning happens wherein the cutting of unnecessary extra fat happens and along with that other body areas muscles are toned okay okay thank you i hope you got the answer yeah Yes. Anything else? Anyone? Any queries? Feel free to ask. All good. Need to Priya, Dolly, Saloni. All good. Okay. Sorry. Yeah, I see. Actually, I watch each and every. It's just that I cannot speak out the names. And need to you do it very good. And जो भी गलत करेगा आई विल डेफिनेटली मैं ओके सो डोंट वरी ऑल्सो आई ऑब्जर्व हु इज ज्वाइनिंग फॉर द फर्स्ट टाइम जो फर्स्ट टाइम कर रहा है उसको हम करेक्ट नहीं कर सकते पूरा एक ही दिन में लाइक मेनी पीपल से कि नहीं हो रहा ये भी नहीं हो रहा वो भी नहीं हो रहा नहीं होगा फर्स्ट टाइम में किसी से नहीं होता इवन इवन इफ आई टेक अ ब्रेक ऑफ वन मंथ एंड आई डू इट अगेन मुझसे भी नहीं होगा बिकॉज अ बॉडी नीड्स टाइम टू गेट हैबिचुअल ऑफ सर्टन थिंग So, थोड़ा सा जल्दबाजी में रहते हैं कुछ लोग बट इट्स टोटली फाइन इट्स जस्ट द क्यूरियोसिटी सो जस्ट टेक एवरी थिंग स्लो इफ यू आर न्यू फॉर पीपल हु आर न्यू हेयर डेफिनेटली यूल फील द चेंजेस इन योर बॉडी आफ्टर यू नो सर्टन वीक्स ऑफ प्रैक्टिस यस 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 मेनी पीपल आर हेयर विद दिस गुड बेली फैट सो Again, like I mentioned to the other person also, belly का सिर्फ belly का नहीं करना है उसके लिए. You have to work on the overall body. Belly fat is very rigid fat. It takes time to cut off. It will take time. Like other body parts, reduce fat very easily, but belly is very rigid and uh, 
difficult to lose it takes time so it will be slow but you'll feel keep checking every month like month wise ya aap usko measurements bhi karo see if there is very small inch loss also that is also very good progress okay yeah thank you thank you so much everyone okay let's leave thank you take care bye bye